So these genetics questions, uh, these genetics short answer questions uh, can sometimes be a bit tricky. Um, so we're going to go through this long question uh, first of all. So to read the question, explain the consequences of a base substitution mutation with regard to transcription and translation. Um, and we're going to use sickle cell anemia as an example. So the important things to note are the things that we need to define. Remember at the very start we define things. So these are the important things that we need to talk about. Um, given that sickle cell anemia is an example, we won't define that as such. So what is a base substitution mutation? So that's our first point. So base substitution mutation is a type of genetic mutation. It's one of the many types. There's base substitution as well as say frame shift mutations or insertions, things like that. So this is our first point. A base substitution mutation is a type of genetic mutation. What is a genetic mutation? Genetic mutation is a change in the base sequence of a gene. And the final thing is that going back to a base substitution mutation, what is that? So that's when there's a single change in a nucleotide. So there's just one change, so it might go from an A to a T, or from a C to an A, or a G to an A, etc. Okay, so that's our first definition. We've talked about a base substitution mutation and what it is. How about the next thing is trans transcription as well as translation. So here, so transcription is the production of mRNA from DNA. Okay. Same thing with translation. Translation is the production of a polypeptide from mRNA. Good. So now we've done all our basic definitions and already we've got four points there, which is going to be half of our allocated eight points for a long question. And now we have to talk about how sickle cell anemia is an example of this. So in regards to sickle cell anemia, you have a change in the DNA base sequence. And as a result of that, what's going to happen? So a change, so, so we're talking about sickle cell anemia in sickle cell anemia. A change in DNA base sequence leads to a change in mRNA produced. And therefore, a different polypeptide sequence is then translated. Good. And because we're using sickle cell anemia as an example, we have to give specifics. So if you can remember this, it will be very important. In sickle cell anemia in sickle cell anemia glutamic acid is replaced by valine so the, the easy way to remember this is that g is before V in alphabetical order. So then G will be replaced by V. So it's kind of like A, B, C, D, E, F, G, blah, 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 blah. Um, Q, R, S, T, U, V. So G goes to V, not the other way around. So glutamic acid is re replaced by valine. 
and this results in sickle cells. So the hemoglobin product results in sickle cells. So what this means is that usually the red blood cells are nice and they're concave, they're biconcave, like this, they're nice donut shapes. But if you look at them, the sickle cells underneath the microscope, they look like this, they look like a moon, which is bad. Because what's the result of the sickle cells? The, the result is that um, sickle cells carry less oxygen. Okay, good. So those are the points that we have. Let's count up how many that we've got. We've got first here, um, mostly which is uh, talking about a single change in a nucleotide um, because you're defining base substitution mutation, but you're also recognizing what a genetic mutation is. Then afterwards we define transcription as well as translation. And then we also, um, we'll get a point, possibly not from this one, but um, yeah, uh, we're talking about a different polypeptide sequence is then translated. Um, and we gave a specific example of which amino acid is involved with sickle cell anemia and the result of the change in protein sequence. So these two down here. Okay, so if we count those, those up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, we've got eight points which should give us maximum marks for this long answer question. Second question, to find the terms gene and gene mutation. So this is relatively short, so we're only looking for four points. So what is a gene? You should know this back to front by now. So a gene is a heritable characteristic which is controlled, which is encoded by a sequence of nucleotides. And the fact that it's heritable, so it's inherited, is very important. So if you have a mum and dad, then they'll pass on some of their genes to their kids. And then, then this characteristic, whether it be hair or eyes or how tall they are, that will, be, uh, that will influence the children as well. Okay, so gene mutation. What is that? So this is, we mentioned before in the previous question, a change in base sequence of a gene. And that will only give us one mark because the next thing that you need to know is that you should always give an example for each of these. So we said before with, um, a, with a gene that you might get an example that uh, an example of a gene is, let's talk about the haemophilia gene. It's a haemophilia gene. Um, an example of a gene mutation is uh, the sickle cell anemia. Sickle cell anemia. And what type of mutation is that? It's a base substitution mutation. Okay, and the way that marks are most likely going to be allocated for this, you probably get like half a mark each for each of these questions. Okay, so that's one mark there. Talking about a heritable, that's a mark within itself, um, encoded by a sequence of nucleotides. That's probably another mark as well. And then for gene mutation, that's a, uh, a change in the base sequence of a gene. So that's very, very simple one. So you're looking at four marks there, so that's four out of four. Okay? There are plenty more YouTube videos for you to check out. Just click on the links below. If you'd like to download the questions, as well as the answers, make sure to like us on Facebook first. And finally, if you'd like to find out how I got a 7 in high-level IB biology, make sure to check out our website in the bottom right-hand corner. Thanks.